Meteorological seasons are based on kind of the weather patterns. So where I live in the Northern Hemisphere, that means summer is June, July, August, because those are the three hottest months of the year. Now, you'll notice that this gets away from the solar calendar quite a bit. In, 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 uh, to be specific, it's lagging. It's falling behind the solar calendar. And we call this seasonal lag. What the seasons actually feel like lags behind the sun's activity. And you can think of it in a few different ways. The first way is just in terms of it takes a while to heat things up and to cool things down, right? So imagine you take a pot of water, you put it on the stove, you turn the stove on high. So the stove is as hot as it's ever going to get right away. Is the water as hot as it's ever going to get? No, it's going to take, I don't know, some amount of time, let's say 10 minutes for that water to get up to boiling. Okay. Uh, by that same token, if we turn the stove off, it's now going to get cold. Is the water cold? No, the water needs a long time to cool down. It's going to stay hot for a good long time. And this is basically exactly what's happening uh, with our seasons.